Welcome to weeks 14 and 15 of my pregnancy update. Um, at the end of week 15, baby is the size of a peach, and I am weighing 151.6 pounds, which means I am down 2.8 pounds since the beginning of the pregnancy. I ordered a pregnancy pillow last week, and that came in, so I am sleeping so much better. I am so much more comfortable. So if you are pregnant and thinking about getting a pregnancy pillow, just do it. It's so worth the money, I promise you. As far as best moments, um, in these two weeks, there's gonna be two, one for week 14 and one for week 15. In week 14 um, would be July 27th, because that puts me at 14 weeks exactly, and that means I am officially into my second trimester. Best moment of the week in week 15, which is not pregnancy related, um, but it was just a huge step for us. We met with a mortgage company to start the process of getting us in order to purchase our first home. Um, it was my goal to purchase our first home in 2018, but because we have so much going on, um, I just don't think that that's gonna be a possibility. So um, we, our lease, we're renting here, and this lease is up in May of 2019. So that is our time frame. We will be purchasing our home by May of next year. And so that meeting was just really exciting to kind of know where we stand and to know that we will be able to get our ducks in a row to make that purchase by May of next year. No, I didn't have any doctor's appointments in weeks 14 or 15. Symptoms, um, I'm starting, and actually this started a couple weeks ago, but I'm noticing a lot of like back acne, and it's disgusting, I hate it. Um, but I bought a back like brush and some acne scrub, so I've been using that, hopefully that'll help with that. Um, I'm also having constipation and heartburn, as always. Um, I'm also noticing a lot of round ligament pain when I'm sitting up too fast or turning a certain way like I'm, the round ligament pain is really becoming prevalent in weeks 14 and 15. Also um, in week 15 headaches started up again which sucks because I was hoping I would be done with those in the first trimester but um, yeah headaches are back. Food cravings, um, I was craving an olive garden salad so bad. Um, and it like specifically had to be an Olive Garden salad and um, we were eating at a different place and I got a salad and I tried to order it with like the exact same stuff that's in an Olive Garden salad, which is super basic, but it still just didn't do it for me. And actually, I still really want an Olive Garden salad. Food aversions, um, Taco Bell. And my husband loves Taco Bell and he wants to eat it all the time and anytime he suggests it, I'm just like, Ugh, Taco Bell. What I miss this week, again, not pregnancy related, but um, I miss my daughter being little. I got a, um, she's still little, she's only 15 months, but, um, I got a Snapchat um, flashback to a year ago and it was a video of her when she was first starting to like really hold her head up and she's like doing tummy time. I'll put the video in here so you can see it but she's like holding her head up and she's just, oh my gosh, she's so little and it just makes me miss her being that small. What I'm looking forward to um, again is our anatomy scan and seeing, and I could say baby girl now because now you guys know because my last video, um, seeing baby girl number two. Um, seeing her again for the anatomy scan, the anatomy scan is probably one of my most favorite parts of the pregnancy just because you get to spend so much time seeing them and I just can't wait to see her again. Um, and also we always do a family um, reunion. We all go to a lake here in New Mexico up north and my grandparents rent a big cabin and it's like my entire dad side of the family so i'm really looking forward to that nope not feeling movement yet and no stretch marks yet that'll do it for weeks 14 and 15 um, of this pregnancy i hope you guys enjoyed it if you did make sure you give it a thumbs up subscribe if you're new and we'll see you guys for my next video bye